morning. Good morning. I want to go into some real talk for real targets. And the reason why I'm saying real targets is, uh, in case you haven't noticed, the internet has been flooded the last few handful of years with operatives uh, pretending to be targets. And what is the purpose of that to discredit real targets? So, if you are a real target, wouldn't you want to appear credible? And not just appear credible, but be credible. <laughs> and what I mean by that, all right, uh, sorry for the lighting, but um, yeah. So what I mean by that is, look, I understand that some things aren't provable all the time. And all of my experience about targeted individuals, or all of my knowledge, comes from direct first-hand experience. Every single thing I talk about in my videos, every single solution, I've done it. Okay? I'm here. <laughs> Clearly. So, my intent is to help, not harm. But here's the thing. If somebody... Like, I see in groups all the time where... If you ask someone for proof, or if they, say, post a video of a car in a parking lot, like literally a car in a parking lot, they say, oh, this person's stalking me. Well, who is this person? All we see is a car in a parking lot. If you can pull out your camera for that, you can pull out your camera for the car following you, right? And you can also show that it's the same car over and over and over and over. Okay, now anyone can do anything. I can look out my window and I can say, see, there's a car there. Yeah, they're stalking me. See that dog? They sent the dog to get me. Come on, dude. Like, <laughs> do yourself a favor. If that's really all you have, don't post it because you're embarrassing yourself and the rest of the real... TI community. Now, my own personal experience before I was even targeted, or before I, sorry, before I knew that word, targeted individual, before I knew what was going on, I was already documenting evidence of the crazy stuff. I just thought, whoa, nobody's ever going to believe this. This is insane. I bought a video camera to videotape because... As the targeting was going on, they were doing these things and then slandering me at the same time. And if I would have had no proof, I could have easily been locked up. All right? So, <laughs> come on. Like, even before I made claims that I'm a targeted individual and I'm being gang stalked, I had tons of evidence. Don't believe me? Go watch my gang stalking playlist. That's all me. That's all... <laughs> And that's only scratching the surface, okay? And keep in mind, I've been deleted off of YouTube over a dozen times, Facebook three times. Yeah, so that's what remains after reposting, 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 whatever. And there's other channels in there and other names where other people posted things that were deleted. <clears throat> mm, yeah, all right. So I know being targeted isn't fun. I know that initially, and even, now, you know, even talking about it is re-traumatizing myself, right? You can tell I start talking faster and getting anxious, and I'm not like this in the other videos. Why is that? Okay, because I'm re-traumatizing myself. So here's my advice to you. If you are a real target then why are you sitting on Facebook all day long rehashing drama over and over? Hey, pups. <laughs> I'll be out in a minute. <laughs> Rehashing the same crap over and over and over and this, that, blah, blah, blah. You're letting them get into your head. Right? And that's part of the game. It's a psychological mind fuck. So why would you allow that? Let me ask you, what are you doing to help yourself? Oh, everybody's out to get me. Oh, I, I can't go outside because every single stranger on the street is, is after me. Dude, come on. That's not real. 
that is in your head. And I think it's important to note here that the symptoms of what people claiming are to be V2K really are, in fact, the symptoms of schizophrenia. But I also want to bring up the flip side and go check out Dr. Colin Ross. Less than 6% of the people who are actually diagnosed with that are actually schizophrenic. So, what am I saying here? Maybe you are, maybe you aren't. But if you are taking drugs for this trauma or the voices in your head or this and that, then you definitely are, in fact, crazy. And you can check it out yourself. Scientific fact. No chemical imbalance has ever been proven in the brain other than those that were induced after the drugs were introduced. DrPeterBregan.com, EmpathicTherapy.org. Go check these things out. And if you want free information from these people, you know, go to their websites, listen to my old shows. Go back to Soul Journeys Radio circa 2008 to 2013, before I was erased as a real target. Oh, documented. Okay, so what are you doing to help yourself? Are you letting it get into your head or are you going outside and going for a walk? Uh, taking care of yourself? Are you getting fresh air? Are you getting fresh sunshine? Are you in the city? Are you hooked up to electronic devices, smart meters, Wi-Fi all around you? Power, whatever, phone towers. Of course you're being electronically harassed. Every single person living in that environment is. You're not being singled out. So what are you choosing to do about it? Sit there on the computer and cry? Or are you going to go outside and do something for yourself? Get some exercise, get some sunshine, get some fresh air. Are you going to eat healthy foods? Or are you eating dead, microwaved, radiated foods and popping your pills and drinking alcohol? <laughs> You're not helping yourself. Let's get real, okay? <sighs> All right. Oh, and for the stalker... Uh, conspiracy creators. Oh, look, she's wearing a leopard print and uh, uh, she's a MK Ultra trying to program you. Dude, take it up with Goodwill. It's first uh, almost fit me. <laughs> cool. Uh, mm, nighty. I got to buy the first nighty I've been able to buy for myself in years. So take it up with Goodwill. All right. So, um... How can you spot a fake? I've already done extensive videos on that, but I just want to bring up for the purpose of what's going on in the Facebook groups. If someone asks a question and the other person flips out, oh, I don't have to provide proof, just my... Yeah. And it's over stupid stuff, right? Like one person asked, well, how do you know it's this group? Well, you're a COINTELPRO, you're an operative, how dare you ask me? <sighs> okay, red, red flag, block, block, block. Like, even if they're not attacking you, block them, get rid of them, get them off your page, because they're going to end up doing the same thing to you, or they're just there collecting names or stories or whatever. Don't feed the trolls, okay? Oh, I hate talking about this traumatic shit. Like, seriously, I have like 2,000 videos. <laughs> if you're new, I get it. You don't know where they all are. Ask me. <laughs> or look in the playlists and look at the titles. Or go to the search bar on my YouTube page and say, type in a keyword. Targeted individual, gang stalking, health, arthritis, brain injuries, um, you know, if you want to learn health stuff or gardening or herbs or how to make your own toothpaste or deodorant or, you know, and this is my point and why I do what I do. I use my experiences to help others. And what did I learn from it, right? And again, go watch my TI winning tactics. I think there's two parts. Maybe the video got cut off or something like that. Um... And that will give you more specific things. But look, I'm begging, I'm pleading with you. If you are a real target, <laughs> you can't just go out there and just, like, show videos of cars on streets. Guess what? Cars drive on streets all the time. Ferries. 
there was this one guy trying to convince me that the fairy always knew when he was going to the bathroom. And so the fairy knew, like, 30 miles away to be in this one spot where if he looked out the window when he went to the bathroom, he would see the fairy. Oh, but you just don't understand. Yeah, I do understand. You watch way too much TV. You watch way too much negative videos. You feed way too much negativity. And let me tell you something. Those of you targeted individuals that think you're, you know, Kristen and you're part of this 144,000 of, you know, perfect people that are going to be saved or whatever. Okay, so assuming you actually do love God and read the Bible, why are you going against it? Why are you going against him, her, it, whatever, whatever you believe? Yeah, you're going against it through replacing that which is natural with that which is synthetic. You are not taking Jesus's advice, right? What did he do? He turned over the changers, you know, the, the money changers, the banksters, the religions, fuck this shit, you know, but you're still following them, right? Yeah, you're eating unnatural foods, you're living an unnatural lifestyle in a little cubicle or in your room, and, and you're making excuses why you can't do anything for yourself. You can't, I did, as a single fucking disabled woman, uh-huh, even with two children in a wheelchair, and after my children were kidnapped, unable to walk or talk, without a memory, lost my memory, my brain blew up, look it up. Yeah, I healed myself. I quit begging other people to do things for me, right? Like, okay, well, clearly I'm not going to get help here. I'm going to have to invest this time in nourishing myself. What did I do? I went to pretty places. I went to nature. I sought quiet and solitude, and which is healthy for your brain. The distractions, the noises, the Wi-Fis, the everything in the city, in your house, in your apartment, and wherever you're sitting right now is not conducive to a healthy lifestyle. If you are targeted, take responsibility for yourself to make things better. Okay? Yeah, I'm a little passionate about this. Why? Because I've done it. And I'm tired of the excuses. Yeah? So, you don't have to remain in a prison. Okay? There's nothing to fear, including fear itself. And if you want more specific tips, then go watch the TI Winning Tactics Part 1 and 2. But there are things that work worked for me big, big time, and I still continue to do. But again, if you're a real target, get out that damn video camera. Everybody has a cell phone right now. Everybody has a webcam or screenshots on their computer, whatever it is. If you're making excuses <laughs> or you don't have a screenshot... Of anybody slandering you anywhere? Come on, dude, really? Not one? It's probably bullshit, all right? So, yeah, the drugs aren't helping you. The fake synthetic processed foods, the Wi-Fi, the vibroacoustic disease you get by all of the appliances and everything running constantly around you. You want peace? You want harmony? Go off grid, you know? Yeah, it's a struggle. That's why I shared my struggle, even while I was screaming and crying and begging, Uncle, mercy, please help. Nobody did, but I kept going. You can too. I'm not fucking special, man. I'm sick of people making excuses, really. You can do it, too. If you're a real target, do yourself a favor. Get off your butt. If you really are thinking you're this chosen, whatever, one of God's people, this, that, then prove it. Prove it with your actions, not your words. Sitting on Facebook all day, belittling other people and things like that. Sorry, that's not very Christ-like. That's not the actions of somebody who, you know, look, by their fruits you will know them. It's all about the action. Save the words. Do. All right. Have a good day.